In this video, you'll learn how to create a table using Google Chrome. This is an example of a table. Begin by clicking on the name of the site you want to work on. Then click Pages. Select the page group you want to work on. Then select the name of the page you want to work on. Select the area of the page you want to work on. And then click on Page Layout. Double click inside the frame you want to add the table to. Then click the Insert Edit Table icon. Here you'll see you can change the number of rows, the number of columns, you can change the width and the height. Below this you can change the cell spacing and the cell padding. This controls the amount of space between each cell and the padding between each amount of text or image in the cell. You can also select if there will be headers in this table. You can change the border size and the alignment of the table as well. You can also give your table a caption and a summary. Click OK when you're done. To add text or images inside any cell, first click inside the cell. Let's add an image to this cell. Click on the Insert Image icon in the toolbox. Locate the image you want to add and then click on it. You can also center this image at any time. Just click on the image and then click the Center button. To add text to any cell, just click inside of it and start typing. In the next cell, we're going to add text and an image. First, type the text you want. Then click on the Insert Image icon. Then click on the image you want to add. Now let's highlight both of these so that we can click the Center Justify. Now let's click on Source View so we can see the settings of this table. This text, border equal 1, controls the thickness of the frame around your table. You can set this to anything between 0 and 6. 0 would remove the border lines. 6 would be the thickest border lines possible. You can also change the width and the height here. You can also change the table's alignment. as well as the cell padding and the cell spacing. Click Source View again to get back to the regular view. You can maximize the editor size with this button. You can insert a navigational dropdown using this button. This one would create a link. Clicking on this would insert a symbol into your table. You can also add another table inside your table if you wish. Scroll down and click OK when you're done. Always remember to save your text frame changes as well. Now you've learned how to create a table using Google Chrome.